Hello everybody, I'm Serta and welcome back to Forever Skies. Well, it's been a short while since the last episode and uh, the reason for that was because I needed to go and find honey. So I went out, I found some honey, came back here, put it through the virus analyzer, got the sample, realized that I needed more honey to be able to actually create the hypothermia booster, and then went out again. So yeah, I got a lot of new stuff on me, but uh, also I have some honey, so... So we are finally, hopefully, going to go into the Underdust Tunnels. Lot to do, so let's get stuck in. Alright, very first thing on the list. Get this sorted out. And analyze. So we're looking for small uncharged and alkaline. Oh, we've already done this, so we just have to do that. So you only have to analyze something once, and once you've done it, then then it's sorted. Now I've got the meningitis virus isolated, and I've already been in here and researched the hypothermia booster. Oh, we can also, yeah, we'll we'll get to this, but we can also do the endurance booster. But let's pop in here, and there's the hypothermia booster. I will get that, and you need a medical reagent as well haven't checked out how to make that uh, on my travels caught one of those centipede things and i put that through the virus analyzer and got the pyrexia virus isolated and now i can research the endurance booster so that's another thing out of the way and we've got the hypothermia booster now i need some sleep i'm going to queue up some food offload all of this stuff and have a sleep and when i am all ready i will be right back okay i'm pretty well rested um i think i'll put that in there i'll consume that oh that's put us pretty well up so we have the hypothermia virus we've got a crystal battery i have a bit of water i don't have any food we'll just take a just take some of the old food rations with me just for fun but crossbow bolts yep okay i think i think i'm ready to head down so let's do this thing we we have arrived all right so i'm gonna head out over this way okay so i'm in this little courtyard oh, it just reminds me i can break that down and that will offer me a shorter way back to the lift grab some oxygen I'm going to take that hypothermia booster now. It does last a while, so that's good. And now that should let me pass this plant. Yes, it does. And more crystals. But most importantly right now, is we can scan this. And we have a wrecked storage box. Excellent. All right, we're out of here. Let's get into the tunnels. All right, we are in the tunnels. There's kind of a central location. This is stuff I'm looking for. Bottle resin. And I need to collect a lot of that. Okay. Good oxygen sorted. Got another battery. Lovely. Quite a lot of places in here to explore. But yeah, just grab as much bottle resin as you like. Or as you can carry because uh, we're going to need this for making epoxy because there doesn't seem to be a lot of it in the world and then just keep running back for more oxygen all right let's go and see what's down this way uh put a crystal med kit all right uh, i think i came from this direction yeah all right and there is a there's a ladder over this side. And there are some more bottles. I'm going to leave those. I have so many bottles. But I am going to climb up here. Because I know that there are things up here. So we've got some plastic. And hopefully we've got... Wow. Wow. I was supposed to get the mother load of plant oil here. Or plant resin. Warning. Oxygen level is low. Alright. That area seems to have extended, so I'm going to have to 
spend a bit more time up there. All right, what do we have in here? Uh, more crystal. Oh, yeah, hello. I needed one of those. Why can I not take that one? Oh, I did. I just wasted arrows. Oh, there's stuff in here. Repair foam. Repair foam. Oh, I got the repair thrower and foam. Okay. Warning. Oxygen level is low. Alright, let me get out of here. Before I perish. So weird that there's no... No resin in these. Huh. Uh, well, here's some. We have picked up nine plant resin so far. Uh, there's water. I can use a bit of that. I don't really need the energy right now. So I'll hold on to that for a moment. Huh. More resin over here. Alright, then we head down this way. And that happens. These are nasty creatures. Okay. And then we can grab these. Now we can also research hemorrhagic fever. I should research. Can I research that? No. Die. And clear the path. Oh, here we go. Cutscene. Oh boy. Immunity permanently reduced to 50%. That is not good. Alright. So I think we found Noah. Well, the one who will come here after me. The voice said it would bring help, but I know it would be too late for me. I leave behind the research formula for the immunity booster. It's not easy to craft it. You'll need glands of these huge insects. Try to find one that is dead because the hunt could end badly. Now get to work. Craft the booster to protect yourself from radiation and get the medicine research results from the lab. The voice will help you. It looks like this is the end of my journey. I'm getting weaker and weaker. I don't have the strength to continue. Tell my loved ones that I did my best. The plants are pulling their tendrils towards me. They want me to become part of them. And I want that too. Okay. Good. We found Noah. And we found... Hello. Oh, this little cutie pie. Alright, we need to get out of here. And we made it just in time. I'm going to do one more sweep through here, just to make sure that I haven't missed anything. Alright, so the one thing we haven't found is the meteor bean seed. I'm going to see if I can find that. All right, well, I've I've been pretty much everywhere. I've chopped at everything. I cannot find this meteor bean seed. So, you know, comments if uh, anyone knows. But yeah, let's get out of here and head to the top. Go and do the next thing. All right, we're back. So first things first, let's go get the sample sorted out. And analyze. So we're looking for small, negative, and neutral. So we get rid of, well... If we get rid of large, that's everything. Okay, I'm going to get rid of the large again. And then the uncharged. And then this one, I'm going to get rid of all the mediums. Get rid of the uncharged. And that just leaves us with the alkaline to get rid of. And that should be that. Nice. Take that. Ooh. 
we can actually make plant resin from dust daisies. Oh, nice. What if we can plant dust daisies? That would be awesome. All right. Uh, immunity booster. Oh, we need the gastro. So how do we get gastro? Gastro, lobster pepper, potato, or dust lettuce. Oh, that's the colander. I didn't need that. Maybe I'll just cook it. Damn, that honey just disappears so quickly. Actually, you know what? I'm going to use it. Need another battery there. Get that colander in here. Rotten food. Go on. Okay, and before the honey goes off, let's just get that last one. And let me see if I can build a, a planter. I don't know if I can plant the dust daisy. I'm hoping I can. Big garden pot. Hopefully that'll do it. Okay, so these don't stack. I'm going to need a... We now have the storage box. So I need epoxy and metal. But before that, circuit boards, electric element, and epoxy. All right, let's see if this works. Can we plant that there? Oh, we can't. Well, well, that's a little sad. But I suppose we can research epoxy. So let's do that. And then we can at least make some epoxy. Yeah, bad news. We can't grow dust daisies. Okay. I need to get the epoxies together. Now that I can craft them. And this makes five from three plant resins. Fantastic. That should allow us, hopefully. If I've got everything else on me. You docking plank. Uh, no, electric elements and circuit board. I have quite a lot of electric elements now. There we go. We're going to get the docking plank at last. I'll take a lobster pepper and get that gastro thing researched. Can't remember if I did it. No, I just got lots of meningitis. Alright, so it's a new one. Get rid of medium. Then... Yeah, so we want large. Get rid of the small ones. And negatives. Yeah, small ones going again. Positives are leaving. And they're neutrals. Cool. Gastro is done. So we should be able to come over here and do the immunity booster now. There we go. Cool. Immunity boosters researched. But what do we need for the docking plank? More epoxy and another circuit board. Circuit board, no problem. And epoxy will be no problem. Now? Yes. Finally. Wow. That was a long road. Now we also need to do that upgrade station. But for now, this docking plank is going... Why will it not let me put it down? Position blocked by what? Oh, I see. This, uh, yeah, where, where we parked is a problem. All right, well, it's going over there, and then we can just move this guy and just pop that over here for now. There we go. We got a docking plank, and that means we may never have to land again. All right, the upgrade station. More epoxy and a motherboard. Motherboard needs needs three circuit boards. Three circuit boards needs uh, lots of stuff. And I think I have just enough electric elements left. But I don't have enough plastic, so. And just a little bit of epoxy. And we get the upgrade station. All right. Well, once most of the machines are researched and built, uh, it won't be, there won't be so much back and forth scraping for resources. We can spend more time concentrating on the ship. And was mentioned in my comments that uh, Bloom is quite nice. I have already sort of conceded. I'm not going to find metal walls for a while, so I may as well. All right, this is a big machine. So, um, yeah, I hope I've got space. I do. Right there. I'm going to have to extend the ship out. But, yeah, we can use this now. And that allows us to do certain things. Oh, look, a green colander, more plastic, and the small oxygen tank that I am using. So, 
All right, so I have the plastic. I have a green calendar. And now I can upgrade medium oxygen tanks. I also have enough epoxy. I just need a bit of metal for the storage box. How did all my metal get finished? Well, I've got so much in here. It's crazy. So let's research the storage box. Take the medium oxygen tank. There we go. 150 seconds compared to 100. Nice. Storage box, what do we need to make it? Epoxy, metals, and a bit of synthetics. Quite a bit of synthetics, like 50 of them. All right, I've made, my, I've made a soft cushion. Not for myself, but for this little dude. And there we go. Cutest insect on the planet. And I can finally make one of the big storage boxes. Grab something to eat. All right, this is a lifesaver. Okay, I'm going to put it over here for now. Oh, should I? I don't really have enough space for anything else. Look how much space is in this one. So I'm going to drop all these goodies in there. Yeah, I need to still craft an immunity booster. There we go. I feel much better now. Let's eat that. Good. Food is good. Water is good. So to craft the immunity booster, we need a medical reagent, which needs preternatural, preternatural seeds, which I have no idea about as yet. Immunity booster. I think I might have left one downstairs in the lab, one of these medical reagents. I'm going to go and have a look for it. Immunity booster gastro and hemorrhagic i'm gonna have to see how i find those okay so gastro i think i might have one of these and hemorrhagic is with a gland i think i might have one of those as well nope seems i don't <clears throat> all right so let's uh let's grab a patate and go and do this thing should i research this Maybe not. Right, gastro is done. And then I just need to get this done. That's already done. I already made one of those. Right, so gastro and hemorrhagic. I should be able to... Oh yes, just that last thing. Oh, that just means I'm going to run downstairs very quickly and go and see if I can find a medical reagent. And now I can test my new... My new air tank. There we go, 150 seconds. Shouldn't have any problem getting up to the top. Ah, there we go. So I did leave one behind. And there's a crystal battery. <laughs> that must have respawned. All right, let's get out of here and go and sort out our immunity booster. Oh, seems I missed an area. Oh no, I didn't. What is that? Meteor vine. Oh, that is what I'm looking for. Okay, I will go down and fetch that. I think maybe I'll grab a couple more. oxygen first all right well that that hornet nest definitely respawned all right meteor bean seed sorted ah, it's all right there's another one over here oh that's just the bean all right well now i have everything so i uh, no real need to stay in this area anymore all right so uh immunity booster Cool. Now let's see if this meteor bean can be planted anywhere. What is it? That's the bean. There's the seed. Big plant. Big seed. Plant. Add water. There we go. And we have the immunity booster. 
now we have to reach the next exclamation mark which is about a kilometer and a half to what looks to be the west so the upgrade station looks slightly different than i remember but uh yeah we'll be able to upgrade our turbines our engines and we'll get the automatic insect catcher as well in fact yeah i should start fishing but we have finished in the underdust and next we're going to move on we're going to find some more interesting stuff and hopefully that sprinkler we can keep things watered going to have to go and find another greenhouse tower somewhere but that is where we're going to leave it if you like this video give us a like if you want to see more subscribe hit the bell icon for notifications leave me your comments let me know what you think uh, now that we have sort of sorted things out a little bit and we have major things that we've been chasing since early in the game i will be expanding out this will go quite far out i've decided to stay four wide because if we go yeah, i might go to six i don't know yet but i do need to move the cockpit we need to put a double cockpit in maybe get another one of these machines and we're going to have to collect a lot of batteries and there's still a lot to do in the game so thank you very much for joining me and until the next time cheers